Breaking news out of Oklahoma right now. Meteorologist Mike Bettis and the Tornado Hunt team were chasing a storm near El Reno, Oklahoma, when the twister picked up their vehicle and tossed it about 200 yards. Here's what we know now. Bettis and his team members are alive, but they do have minor injuries. Mike reported seeing other vehicles that also been thrown by the storm. And Bettis said, I saw my life flash before my eyes in this phone interview. We're, we're ahead of the storm. We, you know, we, we uh, stopped to broadcast with you guys, saw a big, giant wedge tornado, very violent rain wrap tornado. What we're trying to do is just get away from it, uh, get the south side of it and, and, and stay away from it. We ended up all three of our vehicles that we chased with were all hit by it. The uh, two of them are okay and operable. The vehicle that I was in and two photographers, Austin and Brad, uh, we, we took a ride. About uh, the tornado threw us about 200 yards off the highway into a field. Uh, vehicles smashed. Um, everyone had their seatbelts on and just ducked. Our airbags all deployed. Uh, we have a big SUV that we that we ride in, a big GMC Yukon. Uh, the, the roof is smashed in. The front is smashed in. The front wheels are hanging off of it. I don't know what to say. I'm speechless. I mean, that was the scariest moment of my life. I've never been through anything like it before. My life flashed before my eyes. I mean, it was like we were just floating, and then we were tumbling. I mean, we tumbled I don't know how many times. Yeah, I would oh, count man. at least six, eight times we tumbled, and then we were airborne at one point. We were just floating. And we weren't tumbling anymore, and then we came down hard. It was, um, I'm just happy everyone's okay. We've got a few scratches on us. This is one of the first images of the damaged Tornado Hunt vehicle. We'll have updates on Mike Bettis and the Tornado Hunt team as they come in. I'm Matt Sampson with Weather.com.